Canadian wildfires have released harmful pollutants across the Northeast. Places like New York resembled Mars as dense orange smoke moved in. With AQI values spiking in the past few days, it can eventually lead to negative health effects. But what is AQI? AQI stands for Air Quality Index. They are color-coded and are measured all across the U.S. This morning, parts of the Northeast saw darker shades than places like Georgia, who was predominantly in the yellow this morning. What does all of this mean? Well, the Air Quality Index is categorized into six different levels. Green is good, yellow is moderate, Orange is USG, or unhealthy for sensitive groups. Red is unhealthy, purple is very unhealthy, and maroon is hazardous. These levels are based on ranges of the index values. Anywhere between zero and 100, or green or yellow, is typically normal. 100 to 300 is classified as unhealthy for some or most, especially if you're sensitive to pollutants, such as smoke. 300 or more is when you want to be indoors and take precautions seriously. Here's what you can do to stay safe when the AQI is too high. Again, stay indoors and be sure to be in an area with filtered air. Also, keep your activity levels low so that you are breathing in less air. Run your air conditioner with a clean filter to keep the air around you healthy. Air cleaners are also a good option as long as they don't emit ozone. Lastly, avoid using anything that burns, such as candles, cigarettes, or your fireplace. Doing these things can keep you safe when the air around us becomes dangerous. I'm meteorologist Jordan West, 13 WMAZ News.